Oh, they're they're fighting. Hello, interwebs, and welcome back. I'm Shanna, and this is why I share my life and stories, adventures, and opinions, and whatever else I feel like. And we are back with a different kind of video this time. I'm really excited because I know I'm sitting here in my live streaming setup again, but I wanted to bring you guys this game that I found on Switch, and it was either really free or really cheap. The description sounded really interesting at the time that I bought it, and I think I want to play it with you guys on here. We'll probably not finish the game in this video, but if you enjoy it, let me know and we can continue it. The game is called Breeder. Now, let me read to you the description of this game really quick, and then we can go ahead and get started. Let me switch the screen for you. Okay, so the description says Breeder Homegrown is a short horror game about a family dealing with a strange creature over several generations. You will encounter some puzzles, but the game relies mostly on atmosphere, music, and dialogues. The whole experience takes about 40 to 90 minutes, depending on how much you want to explore. Probably going to take way longer than that for me. We're going to try and limit this video to 20, 25 minutes and see where we get. But guys, without too much rambling, let's go ahead and... Get into it. All right, so let's go ahead and hit new game. Turn it down on my TV. So my microphone isn't also picking up the game volume or game audio. Officer, where did you last see him? Nurse, I put him to bed yesterday. Officer, and this morning? Nurse, he, I don't know. We looked for him everywhere. Officer, and you're sure he's not hiding somewhere in the clinic? Nurse, I told you, I looked everywhere. He never does this. Officer, is he dangerous? Nurse, what? No, of course not. He's an old man, officer. Officer, a crazy old man. Nurse, it's not like that. He just forgets things. Beep, beep, beep. This is a quick reminder to let you guys know that you should hit that subscribe button if you haven't. And if you like the video at any point, go ahead and hit that like button as well. Sorry for the interruption. I'm going to shut up now and let's get back to the video. grounded for a week. Hey buddy, I have to go home now before my parents notice I'm gone. Where are we? What is this place? I know, but don't worry. I will be back soon. We're talking to the monster. You're the best, buddy. It's a river and flowers. <laughs> must have reached the end of whatever this is. The path is really dark though. It's dark both directions too. Oh. Oh, pretty. Ooh. 
the lights flicker as we walk under them. Oh, we can't cross the river. Yes. Buddy, are you going to die one day? That's what I thought. Don't worry, if something happens to you, I'll find a way to bring you back. Okay, it's the same conversation. What in the world? Okay. Too dark. Not gonna keep going that way. Can't see anything. Mushrooms, stepmother Jacqueline hates them. I'm like trying to see if I can interact with everything. I guess you can only interact with certain things. Trees, they look a bit like the trees of the forest surrounding my garden. I, keep, I can't keep following the lights. Nope, that is there. Ooh, a door. I don't want to leave without my stone. My stone? Do we have to find... Do we have to find some sort of stone? This was live, I'd be like, where should I go? Oh, it's a girl! I can't reach it. Okay, so let's try going this way. Who's the girl? I want to know who the girl is. Mom! It's Mom. Your buddy needs your help, sweetie. Do it for me. Take the stone. I can't reach it. I can help you. Did you brush your teeth like I told you to? Of course. Very good, sweetie. What are these stones for, Mom? You will understand soon enough, sweetie. Be on your way now. And I guess we got whatever we needed. Some kind of weird stone. Don't know what it's for. Now let's go back to the door. Here's this one, right? Yeah. Ha ha, who needs a map? Not me. I got here. Oh, where the hell are we now? This is weird. Did we just come out of a hole in the ground? Okay. Well, I guess we gotta go this way. Can we explore here? Ooh, yes we can, okay. Last night I saw Pop stepping on the garden, like he was trying to ruin it on purpose. Interesting. Why would Pops do that? That's so rude. Okay, this does kind of look like, or these do, kind of look like the trees that were in that uh, weird little world that we came out of and through the hole in the ground. It's like Alice in freaking Wonderland over here, except, you know, not. The pages are filled with weird drawings and maps of some kind of labyrinth. Looks a bit like my buddy's place. Who's your buddy? Is he the monster? I'm friends with the monster that's under my bed. Get along with the voices inside of my head. What if I sang like that? Would you guys still love me? You're probably over there like, we don't love you anyway. <laughs> My duck. I never really liked this sneaky little prick. 
<laughs> wow. Okay. How old are you in this? Like eight? And you're over here like sneaky little prick about your, your duck. What? What? Where in God's name are you coming from, son? I... You were in the cabin, weren't you? Don't lie to us, David. We told you that we won't accept any more lies. I'm sorry. Sorry? Do you think it makes any difference to be sorry? The harm is done. What harm? What's going on? Okay, so I can say it won't happen again, or I was just looking for my robot pops. It won't happen again. Let's not lie. Do you think your father and I are stupid? Not one night goes by without you trying to sneak out. You're nine years old. You have to learn to obey your parents. I suppose. Your stepmother is right. Do you know what happens to children who don't listen to their parents? Mm -hmm. They die or they start to Let's go if they die. Let's be dramatic. No, they don't die. They just become sad. Sad human beings who always regret that they couldn't listen to their parents. Of course they died. Patrick, in this case, do you realize how dangerous it is for a child to go out at night, David? I don't know. Pedophiles? Aliens? No. What? No. I mean, worse things than that, David. Things you don't even know exist. If you can't stop, we will have to lock you in your room. Is that what you want? And no more snuffles. What's a snuffle? What? The fun part. Do you hear that, son? No more snuffles. It won't happen again. I was just looking for my robot pops. Okay, we already that. Don't keep saying that every time. Your robot is in your room. You know that as well as I do. You can't fool us, David. We know you where you went. You have to understand the weight of your actions. From now on, there will be rules in this house. What kind of rule? I'm sorry, stepmother. Jack, I'm sorry. What is it, son? You know you can tell us if something is wrong. Are you being bullied at school? Oh, Patrick, don't you see he's trying to manipulate you again? I'm not letting him manipulate me. I just want to know if something is wrong. You heard about that kid who ended up shooting his classmates, didn't you? What are you talking about? I'm sure his parents didn't listen to him either. Come on, Patrick. Are you this blind? He's just playing the soft card. It's always the same. He knows exactly how to get to you. Tomorrow he will sneak out again, and we will have the exact same conversation again. You have to show some authority, Patrick. What will you do, Pops? Yeah, what will you do, Patrick? I... We could ground him for a few days. A few days? A week? Grounded for a week, David. That's not enough. Look at him. He couldn't care less. I, I don't know. What do you suggest? What do I suggest? I suggest you grow some balls, Patrick. It's the same with you. Oh, shoot. Stepmom's crazy. <laughs> Maybe you should decide stepmother Jacqueline and I go to my room now. So can I go to my room now? Yes, go to... No. We are not finished with you. Do you realize what you did? It won't happen again. I was just like, oh my god. Okay, it won't happen again. Do you think your father and I are stupid of oh, the same conversation? Or if they start doing drugs? Oh, I just gave that an accident. So yeah, exactly. They stop doing drugs. Patrick! They live a life without love. Poor, poor people living away from God. They. Patrick! I don't think that's the point. What your father is trying to say, David, is that we can't trust you to be blind to us all the time. I just went out to the stars. Which stars? The sky is covered with clouds. Is it? Maybe the clouds move. Stop. Patrick, tell your son what you think of him sneaking out on us. It makes me sad. And angry. Yes, of course. Angry. Okay. So let's go with... Are you trying to be a smartass, David? Maybe you would prefer us to send you to the boarding school. Is that what you want? I don't think we can afford... I've had it with you, David. Your father and I, we can't stand it anymore. Do you understand? It won't happen again. I was just looking to my robot. Let's go with it. will happen again. Okay, let's go with... Play do drugs. Some combination that I have. 
full of seafood. Pops got really into that lately. Interesting. That must be the back door or something, yeah. Can't interact with it, so. Gonna assume so. Got a little lamp. Looks like sofas. Tonight, The Fly is on TV. That movie scares me. This must be the TV. Ooh, a window that we can't see out of. Another lamp. What's through here? Ooh, the fox head on the wall. This must be the front door. Today it was nice outside. The people looked happy. I don't know about Pops, though. He just sat on the porch all day whispering weird stuff. We're at house number 112. I wonder if that has significance of any kind. Guess we'll find out. A little spaceship. It's a big bed. I'm assuming this is probably our parents' room. If I were to guess. Then, where's the door? There we go. And we're in the bathroom. Let's brush our teeth. Mom always said that I shouldn't be afraid of monsters. I'm not. My buddy will never let anything happen to me. What if our buddy is the monster? Why is the bathtub dripping? Can we use the toilet? That would be funny. No, I don't think we can. I tried. <laughs> All right. Let's see. What happens if we go this way? Aha, this is our room. Ooh, we can play a game. Woo. Oh no. Oh, it's one of these types of games. I'm so bad at these.
One of my stones hatched. I remember now. Don't sweat it, Paul. Dad's at work. And after all, it's my garden, too. Boy one, I don't want to get into trouble. Girl one, come on, Paul. Don't be such a whim. Boy two, what do you think is in there? Girl one, no idea. It looks like some kind of foxhole. Boy two, I think it might be a crater from a meteorite or something. Mom, there's only one way to find out. I'm going in. Boy one, what? You're crazy. Jeez. Girl one, what do you see? Mom, I don't know. It's very dark in here. Oh, oh, there's something here. Girl one, what? Tell us what you see. Mom, it looks like some kind of snail. It's so cute. Oh. What is the snail doing in my pocket? That was weird. No? That was really weird. That was really weird. All right, guys, I think that might be where we stop for today. So that way this video doesn't get too long. Plus we've, um, you know, learned a little bit about the story, which seems to be really weird. If you guys wanna see more of this, let me know and I will definitely continue the game. I'm interested to see where the story goes, but um, I have to figure out how to save it now. And if I can't, then I guess next time I pick it up, I'll just go through the things that I did and then continue the story for you guys. Let me know what you guys think about what's going on here. It seems a little strange, but I'm kind of into it. Um, definitely a little creepy and uh, I like it so far. But like I said, let me know what you guys think. And until then, that pretty much wraps it up for this one. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please make sure to like comment subscribe and if you don't know what's comment down below leave a little eye emoji not only does it help out my channel a lot but it lets me know that you are here it gives us a chance to chat it lets me know you made it to the end of the video and of course i just love to see your faces down there if you want another way to help my channel down below there's links to my website my merch store and my patreon there's zero obligation to check any of those out but if you want to you can thank you guys so 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 much for watching i appreciate you all so very much remember to stay drinky af and i will see you next time Bye. Oh, hello there. Yes, uh, this is me casually drinking from my Ginky AF merch because uh, I don't have any bloopers to share. But if you like my cup or my shirt 
or some leggings or some socks, there's links in the description below. Be ginky as and enjoy your coffee or tea or water or whatever else you like to drink from mugs.